Hey there, I'm Ty Tatro. I'm with Redtail Overland. We're out here at Overland Expo West. What's behind me here is the first ever uh, hard-sided pop-up rooftop camper. So this is going to be similar to a rooftop tent and it's a kind of shaped like a wedge and goes on top of a car, but that's really where the similarities end and the camper portion begins. So this is going to be fully insulated. It's going to be a super quick setup and breakdown. So this can go up in 10 seconds and down in 10 seconds. And it was really born out of this idea of we had a rooftop tent. We loved the freedom of it. We loved how we could get to various places really easy, bomb down roads, that sort of thing. And in great weather, it was great, but in not so great weather, it was not so great. So we kind of looked at that and we're like, how could we make this better? Is there an opportunity where we could have a pop-up hard-sided enclosure that was comfortable, quiet, we could camp in the wind, we could camp in the snow, we could camp in the rain and be comfortable and actually sleep. And this was kind of born out of that. So we kind of, we started with a philosophy of, we really put price aside at, as a philosophy. And we, we just said, we're gonna go out and make the coolest thing we can. And then we're gonna come back to price. And you know, if, if people buy it, they buy it. And if they don't, they don't. But uh, we really wanted to try to innovate and push the space. And uh, what came out of it was this. So this is our RT110. It's 110 inches long, it's 60 inches wide. This is gonna be a queen mattress plus another 20 inches. That front area we use as a pass-through, so there's actually a door that goes down into the vehicle. So in this vehicle, we go through the sunroof, but you can go through various pass-throughs and vans and, and different vehicles. So it is, in terms of construction, this is full carbon fiber construction. It's billet aluminum. We build it all in-house in Colorado, so we build all the, all the molds. We make all of our own parts there and fully designed. We, we were just awarded a patent on the mechanism itself, so we're pretty stoked about that. Um, from a power standpoint, this is gonna have 330 watts of solar. That's gonna charge a built-in 60 amp hour lithium battery bank, and that's gonna run dimmable interior exterior LED lighting, USB outlets, you've got a fan in there, you have a little inverter to charge your camera batteries, your drone batteries, whatever. And the big thing is that there's a heater in there, so we actually have a little diesel powered uh, heater that will heat this space, make this a full four season uh, setup. So with, with the insulated walls, ceiling and floor, the dual pane polycarbonate windows, you really get that, that comfort in, in kind of any terrain. So really part of, part of developing that, this was uh, trying to keep that open and airy environment of the rooftop tent that we liked so much, but getting these hard walls. So we came out with these windows and we made this whole back wall window. So that's a five foot tall, by 42 inch wide window. And that allows us to enjoy the view, bring the outside in, even when there's inclement weather. This also opens up, so the, the two panes will slide up and the whole back wall opens up. So you can have that nice uh, airy atmosphere in there. We've got screens and shades for all the windows and doors, all super high end materials. And this one, so this is the big one, the 110. It's gonna come in at 300 pounds with the batteries, with the solar and everything. That's gonna be our top of the line product. Um, so that one's gonna be at a 34,500 price point. And for rooftop temp people, that might be a little shocking, but we really try to compare it more from an amenity standpoint to a teardrop trailer. So it really has all the features of a teardrop trailer other than the kitchen, but you don't have to tow it. So you can just keep it on top of your car and uh, makes it really easy to explore roads that you have never been down and stuff like that. And then we'll, we'll be coming out with some sort of a, a modular kitchen setup that you can put on the back of your vehicle. So again, this is the 110, this is the big one. We also do a 90, which is 20 inches shorter, six inches narrower. That's gonna be for your Toyota, your Forerunners, uh, your Tacomas, Broncos, Jeeps, those types of vehicles. This one, the 110, is uh, more for your, your vans. Uh, this is an Expedition Max trucks with toppers, trucks with like a lightener rack or something like that. To learn more about us, we're redtailoverland.com. We're also on TikTok, uh, Instagram, Facebook, at Redtail Overland.